was prepared to go to the After six, we're going to go ahead and start the uh, Gardner City Council work session. We've got one item on the agenda, and it's a uh, discussion of options for our city utility. Um, just uh, to provide a little background, uh, prior to November 2008, all of the utilities were contained within public works. In November 2008, we established an electric utility board uh, and operated the city's electric utility separately. Uh, on February 24th, we changed the electric utility board from an independent, well, a quasi-independent uh, board to an advisory board uh, and brought the electric director back into the organizational chart reporting to the city administrator. On April 15th, we had a uh, panel came in for a work session uh, to provide some insight into various organizational structures, uh, including the uh, executive director of Kansas Municipal Utilities, uh, the mayor McPherson, the general manager of the McPherson Board of Public Utilities, uh, the Ottawa City Manager, the Ottawa Utilities Director, and a, a consultant and former Public Works Director uh, uh, provided input for us. At the uh, uh, and where we where we basically left off there was that we would come back and have a discussion about next steps in try and make a decision on, on which way we wanted to go as far as uh, handling our, our, all three of our utilities and uh, uh, the options that uh, have been kind of brought forward was to uh, either create a, a board of public utilities that would manage the water, electric, and wastewater utilities, create a city utilities department that would manage all three utilities. Uh, place the electric department back within the public works structure, sell one or more of the existing utilities, or leave them as currently structured with water and wastewater 
uh, inside Public Works and the Electric Utility has its own department um, in March and then again in June I provided to council members uh, some recommendations uh, the, the second set of recommendations was, was just a little amplification of what I had provided the first time uh, everybody got a chance to look at that uh, I guess I'd like to start the conversation this evening to maybe see if we could, if we're talking about these five different options, uh, uh, and option number two being a city utility department, and my recommendation would be to have a uh, public utility commission as an advisory group, similar to the electric utility board, how the electric utility board operates now. I've spelled out some of those. Uh, what would possibly be the duties for those uh, for that uh, that board uh, in the recommendations that I handed out? Uh, but between the between the five, I'm, I'm, I was hoping that maybe we could distill this down a little bit. Uh, maybe right off the bat, have a little discussion about uh, whether or not some of these are are things that we're not we don't really have an appetite for and maybe they ought to not be included in the discussion just so that we can get to the heart of the matter. Uh, as a for instance, uh, leave things, number five is leave is currently structured with water and wastewater within public works and the electric utility department is its own department. The way that I see it, I, I, uh, I don't think that's one of the manageable uh, ways to, to structure it is uh, is there anybody that uh, doesn't agree that maybe that's one of the uh, options that we should be eliminating so you're saying leave things as they are do you have a yeah I had that but I didn't say it back actually I've got it actually yeah. Paul, just a little quick you can this that last thing right here yeah okay um, uh, now I'm working from the agenda here as yeah. far as the item number five, okay. which says leave is currently structured water and wastewater utilities within public works, electric utility is its own department. Uh, it doesn't appear that anybody is against that idea. Uh, the idea of eliminating that as, as one of the options. Well, I think that, I think that the way that things are currently structured, I think is kind of the worst of the world right now. I mean, we're not getting the efficiencies of scale of, of being able to consolidate our utilities and at the same time, we're kind of up in the air. Okay. What, what efficiencies are you talking about? I'm talking about the best and most efficient use of taxpayer dollars. If we're gonna, if we're, if we're gonna do this, we should have either all in one department under the city, okay, instead of having it in two separate entities, or, we should, you know, you know, have it set split off as a BPU. I don't think that there is a lot of appetite for having it as a, as it's currently structured. I don't think it's I don't think it's efficient. But it is just a department with an advisory board now. I mean, before it was it was its own entity, Oops. however illegal it was. But 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 I guess what I'm asking is what it really is just a department now with a group that provides advice. No, so it's its own separate. Department. And it's it's currently a department in flux. Uh, we we've got it still answers to sure to a department. I, but to make it easy, I don't think that there's if this is one of the things that you'd like to keep on the table. I'm not sure that the, the consensus of council is going to be with you on that. I'm I'm, I'm just asking is and this guess, one we could move past? I guess from my perspective, I, to me, I would prefer number two. Not I'm not saying not talking for it, but over number five. I would rather all of them be under one director and then the options come down to okay how is that because from my perspective I think there should be um, a board an advisory board if, however we decide to structure it, that board should look at all three utilities I think that from an infrastructure perspective I think it's similar the type of planning and maintenance and things that need to, to happen I think from a, a pay perspective when you look at your employees the um, technical aspects of those jobs are similar. So to me, it just makes sense to, however we do this, that they're all under one umbrella. Is, and 
is my thought. And that sounds like exactly what Steve was saying. We got the high sign from Heath. I, I agree. I like number two. Uh, I don't know if I would say number two. It would be either number one or number two. I think that's more toward the removal of number five. Yeah, the yeah. removal of five, the removal of, I, I don't, and, and, and four to me also is off the table because we won't get the, we won't get the value for the utility of the cell. We just won't. So I would say give it a four and five. Okay. I agree. I don't think selling the best long term. No. Mm -hmm. But that, but when we started this process, that was one of the things we were going to look into is what is it worth? I mean, we, that's what this discussion was supposed to be about. Which uh, actually, you know, I contacted KCPNL and, and one of their vice presidents contacted me back. Uh, honestly, he didn't want to put a whole lot of time or effort into uh, evaluating.